I'm Josh Hall here at the Red Deer Arena for 24-7 Red Deer and the SO Cup 2015 gold medal final game. Two teams fought very hard to get here, the Red Deer Sutter Fund Chiefs and the Sudbury Lady Wolves. Let's take a look at how the gold medal game went down. Obviously not too good right now, but I can at least say that I'm proud of each and every one of the girls in that room. We finished strong, and that's all we could ever ask for. If anyone told uh, told uh, told our girls that we'd be in the in the final and two one down in the final period, I think uh, we would have taken that big time. But uh, no, it's been a fabulous week. I said the, I think the girls got a, a great experience, and uh, obviously losing is is not fun, but. Uh, It'll, it'll make us stronger and build a little bit more character in us. So, uh, but overall, it was, uh, it was a wonderful week uh, for, uh, for Red Deer Sutter Fund Chiefs and also for Red Deer Minor Hockey in the city of Red Deer. You know, you wouldn't have it any other way. I think Canada had a, had a, a great view, uh, had the opportunity to watch an exciting game between two evenly matched teams. Could have went either way. We were fortunate uh, we got a couple bounces. And uh, you need a little bit of puck luck to win, uh, to win one of these championships sometimes. And there you have it, the final score in the 2015 SO Cup gold medal final game from the Red Deer Arena, the Sudbury Lady Wolves 2 and the Red Deer Sutter Fund Chiefs 1. All of the players we spoke to from the Red Deer Chiefs say they are proud of their performances despite taking second place in the tournament. And they all spoke about how they were the first host team to make it to the final. So good for them. Great performance by the Red Deer Chiefs all week. And obviously an even better performance by the Sudbury Lady Wolves who are your 2015 ESO Cup gold medal champions. For 24-7 Red Deer at the Red Deer Arena, I'm Josh Hall.